Hi, good afternoon. I am Catherine McConney. I am the facilitator for this course called Tour Guiding, Professional Tour Guiding, being offered by Costart. The course runs for three months and covers every aspect that you could think of of Trinidad and Tobago. We commence, of course, with the tour guiding skills and introduction to tourism. We focus a little on customer service and then get into the general knowledge on Trinidad and Tobago from history, geology, geography, folklore, customs, festivals, food, you name it, we cover it. When I signed up for this course, I was expecting to achieve a particular skill set, which was to understand and perform the art of tour guiding. Instead, I got a lot more than what I paid for. The knowledge and understanding of what makes us who we are were hidden in the architecture of our buildings, in the cultural norms that were passed on from generation to generation, and in the uniqueness of our geography and our flora and our fauna. So most times it felt like you were given a treasure map with clues along the way. Every clue was a puzzle piece that helped you to understand and cherish and appreciate even more the natural beauty and the rich heritage of our twin island republic Trinidad and Tobago. I had no idea that this course would have been so nice. I was blown away, won by the history. I went to school in Port of Spain, tissue education, and daily I would have passed these historical sites and not know any value and what it meant to Trinidad. And this course opened my eyes, made me have a greater sense of knowledge about the history and the diverse people we have. It opened my awareness of what we have as a country in Trinidad and Tobago, not only cultural, but also the food and festivals that we take for granted, as well as the different people that make up our cosmopolitan society. The different type of people. I didn't even know there's bird watchers, there was, there's people who make chocolate in Trinidad. There are things that you learned about Trinidad and Tobago that you, had, you just didn't know it before. For example, say the, the history of Chaturangas. You know a little bit about Chaturangas, but when you really got, got into, the, into that tour, that Western tour, uh, you learned so much more about what happened back in the World War I, World War II. You learned about the amount of war, war bases that they had in Trinidad and Tobago and the part that Trinidad and Tobago played in, in the World Wars. So that's why I would say it's, it's surprising. It was fun in terms of the, the, my, my, my fellow colleagues, my fellow students. Like the, the, the people that it draws are people that are passionate about Trinidad and Tobago, people who are fun-loving in their own right, um, excited about sharing what we learn with the others who come to visit Trinidad and Tobago. Additionally, Corsat has added in an entrepreneurship aspect of it which is very valuable for the students because tour guides are freelancers it helps them to understand how to create their own business utilizing tour guiding as the main skill and although people don't know tour guiding is actually quite a business that people are getting into there are a lot of tours that are offered for just couples and three people and therefore you can utilize your own vehicle and take people out on tours all over Trinidad and Tobago the course also has field trips in it. Oh my goodness, those field trips are amazing. The students get out there and they experience all aspects of Trinidad and we go to, on a day trip to Tobago. We go to the Pitch Lake, we get as far as Guayaguayari, up to the North Coast, the Western Peninsula. We are all over. I learned about the history of the country, I learned about geography, I learned about the people, the culture, things I knew already and so much more that I didn't. What stood out for me the most was the facts, the historic facts that we have learned. For example, when Port of Spain became Port of Spain in 1797, uh, this type of information I think adds concrete information or knowledge to the commentary for whoever the customer is, whether it's the locals, whether it's international guests. It was good for growth. Um, it, cha it challenged me to grow a little bit and get my my. My, my comfort zone. When we did this course and you learn about say the buildings around the savannah as well you know it just fits in with where I am now in my space and what I would like to go forward doing. This is something doing tour guiding is something that you could do until it doesn't have an age limit as long as you have the passion that you want to do it you want to share 
definitely you know it's something that you could you could do um, for a good while you know no limits I've learned that um, personality must have the right personality uh, the awareness uh, attitude um, being able to make the right judgment should you be out in the field um, as much as we would like to show off to run the baby, we also have to consider safety. Now I want to spread all my knowledge. I want to tell people, hey, come and do this course, not for any hiking adventure or taxi service, just mm -hmm. to, to get the general knowledge. Every citizen of Trinidad should have this knowledge. We qualified at a perfect time. This is the start of the cruise ship season, and I'm hoping to put my theory into practice and so on and what I've learned on the field trips into practice and get my feet wet doing some, some tours. I will support tourism fully and 100% now. Only reasons I'd encourage anybody to do this, besides being passionate and loving your country and wanting to show it off, Costat in particular, their course is an accredited course. It provides four credits, which offers you an opportunity when they offer their tourism management degree that you already have credits towards that. None of the other courses in Trinidad offer that. In fact, the mere fact that it's accredited by the Accreditation Council of Trinidad and Tobago just says, quite frankly, what the course can offer you. I mean, it's extremely valuable in that sense. I would definitely recommend this program to anybody, whether you want to become a tour guide or not. It's good information, it's a good experience. It's one you'll never forget.